And Daughtry is bringing their brand new music to Wisconsin this summer. The new single, As You Are, dropped yesterday, and this song has a great backstory to it. Chris Daughtry joins us now live from Nashville. Honored to talk with you. Good morning, Chris. Good morning. How are you? Well, we are well. We're excited to have you play a couple of times here in Wisconsin soon. We'll get to that in a minute. Let's start with uh, the We're story. As, as well. Yeah. Let's start with the story behind As You Are. Your wife had a lot to do with this song. Yeah, yeah, she was definitely the catalyst for this song. She, uh, uh, we wrote it like three years ago. Uh, we were living in LA at the time. She, um, she, uh, or get got some feelings down on her on some paper and brought it to me and was like, "Hey, um, if you feel inspired to do anything with this in a future song or whatever, feel free. Hint, hint. You know, no big deal." And uh, kind of just left it with me. And um, I read it and and it felt. And it resonated. It felt real, and uh, I picked up a guitar and came up with a chorus for it, and uh, went to work, went to writing it, and got in my studio, put a demo together, and a few weeks later, I played it for, her and there were tears, and mm -hmm. and uh, it, we felt like it was something very special. You know, it's a it's a message about unconditional love, acceptance, accepting yourself. Um, you know, uh, I feel like so many people need to hear that that message especially with the, the kids out there with social media and getting, you know, bullied all over the place, not feeling like they belong in one area or, or another or not having a community of, of support. Now, we mentioned that you are hitting the road and coming specifically to Wisconsin. What do you love about touring and getting to meet folks in all of these communities? I, I think it's that. It's meeting so many different people. I think that's one of the best things about what we do as I've gotten to travel the world and meet so many different people and so many different cultures, so many different walks of life that, uh, that you would never get to experience otherwise and gives you a, just a, a bigger world view, you know? Well, we can't wait to serve you some cheese curds when you come to Wisconsin. The first show in June is sold out, but you'll be at the, the Wisconsin Valley Fair in Wausau August 1st, so people get your tickets and hear this great new song. Chris, thanks so much for joining us this morning. Thank you for having me. Thank you. Yeah, we'll see you soon.